So Fleet Feet couldn't run as well without Daniel. <laughs> he is the store manager. That's right. Uh, five years, they said? Uh, five years, yeah. Awesome. Five years now. Yep. And so not only does he manage the day-to-day -day operations of the store, but he also is the coach for the 5 and 10K training programs. That's right. That's, is that's right. Yep. All right, so tell me a little bit about the training. What yes. do you do? How do you keep people going so and So the energized? program's called No Boundaries. Um, <clears throat> basically, it's an interval-based program. So what we do uh, is we get beginners, people who are experienced, people new to running, people who have already you know, been kind of well adapted to running, and we kind of mold them, kind of develop a way for them to kind of train without getting injured um, and to kind of make it fun for them. So what we do is we give out points and prizes for different groups. Uh, we piece everyone together on the same pace so that way they don't have to feel like they're running faster or slower than anybody else in the group. Um, but basically we just kind of make up a 10-week program, just a, you know, just a fun time just for everyone. So, so it's 10 weeks 10 from weeks start long. to yep. finish. Mm -hmm. 10 weeks long. And so No Boundaries um, is for 5 and 10K? 5, 5Ks and 10Ks. We do two 10Ks a year and then three 5Ks a year. So. Okay. And so um, you start in the winter? Yep, start you in the winter. Yep. <laughs> That's right. We call our Winter Warriors program. Uh, and then we kind of move to our, our Spring Forward, um, our Summer, our Firecracker, you know, Fourth of July one. That, that one's always our biggest one. But um, yeah, we just kind of spring forward and just keep going and get everyone trained up. So. All right, so how'd you get to be a runner? Uh, so I actually started uh, in Fleet Feet in Fayetteville. I was working up there for a while um, and I got involved in their No Boundaries program. So I started running there. Um, and then from there, I just kind of kept taking off and here I am now. So. So how long have you been running? Uh, running wise, probably about seven or eight years. So okay. I, I started when I played baseball in college and just kind of kept it going. So. And you love it. Yeah, I love it. That's right. That's right. See, I, with, for me, well, I, I need to be chased. That's right. Yeah. To run. So. That's right. That's right. And everybody, sometimes people need that that group atmosphere to kind of get them going, which that's what the group, you know, the group brings is basically, you know, accountability and you know, reason to show up every, you know, cold mornings or you know, long runs on the weekends, stuff the like social that. Social aspect. So, that's right. That's right. The bonding. And so we meet two times a week: Tuesdays at six p.m. and Saturday mornings at seven a.m. So, okay. um, those yeah. are reasonable times. Reasonable times. You know, I mean, all the other workouts are on your own throughout the week. You know, it kind of helps, you know, kind of push yourself a little bit as well. So, what's your favorite thing about working for Noel and Sean? Oh, Noel and Sean. I love making fun of Sean's accent, I guess. That's my number one. Uh, Noel, she's awesome. No, they're both, they're both really good people. Um, they do an awesome job, and they're just. They're like friends up here at the store, you know. Family, so, it's that's same. right. Yeah, family, exactly, exactly. Well, we are glad that they are here and offer all that they offer. Yeah. Hey, thanks for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, bye, y'all.